shooting stars, me and Jericho, that's my guy, right? Uh, we go way back, we've done music for a long time, and uh, I knew I wanted to have him on the album. I knew once I started making the song, this is the song I gotta have with Jericho. Our voices blend so well together. What we wanted to do was kind of subvert expectations for that. So it starts off with the claps, right? And you think it's gonna be like a happy, you know, poppy for the floor kind of thing. But then um, I make it halftime because it's gotta be hip hop. So <laughs> that's how you get shooting stars. It's a fun track. Um, I always refer to it as your Kid Cudi song. I don't know if anybody else does that. Uh, you have. So that's, that's a good I, start. I, I, I'm the only one, I guess, but um, to me, it's just kind of like the the way that the beat kind of picks up with that mm -hmm. that kick, kick, kick kind of like, and then kind of gets into that theatrical. Yeah. To me, that's just very Kid Cudi, kind of your other channeling of the Ohio influence, maybe. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, I think especially around here, he's got to be the blueprint in terms of the ideas that I talked about on Shooting Stars. You know, even if, even if it wasn't intentional, there's no way I wasn't thinking about it. You know, let's uh, do a deep dive into the lyrics mm -hmm. because you are on Genius.com. I am Genius.com uh, slash Jamil slash and slash the and it's way so many slashes. Yeah, you know we we we, we uh, stay uh, slashing. I have a, uh, a short link for that because <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Genius doesn't love me right now. That's all right. Um, begin the song begins with habit, dirty habit. What's the habit? Um, just going outside of your situation. You know, so for, for me at least, it was daydreaming. That was my habit, my dirty habit. I closed my eyes, I'm out this planet, you know. Um, but I mean, it could be, it could be just about anything.